Typhoon Kapu has already toppled houses, bridges, and power lines, and could bring more damage with its slow speed. More than 14,000 people have been evacuated as Typhoon Kapu destroyed houses, toppled trees, and knocked out power lines in the Philippines. The Category 4 Typhoon, with winds of 109 miles per hour, 175 kph, hit shore near the northern town of Kasiguran in Aurora Province. At least one person has been killed and others are missing, officials said. Alexander Pama, who heads the government's main disaster agency, said villagers have fled from areas in the typhoon's path, including in towns prone to flash floods and landslides. Toppled electric pylons and trees were making it hard for emergency workers to reach isolated villages. Authorities said 30 flights and ferry services Indiana the North were cancelled. Some bus services have been suspended because of the threat of landslides. Forecasters predict Kapu will remain over the main northern island of Luzon for three days due to high pressure in the north and another typhoon in the northwest Pacific. The center of the storm is moving west at a speed of just 5 miles per hour, 8 kph. It has slowed almost to a crawl. We're hoping it would speed up and spare us sooner, said Mr. Pama. On Friday, President Benigno Aquino appealed on TV for people not to panic. The last time he made a televised appeal was in 2013, the day before Super Typhoon Hien struck the central Philippines, killing over 6,300 people and leaving millions homeless. An average of 20 typhoons hit the Philippines every year.